Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's me Alicia if this is your first time here and if not, welcome back. Okay, the ingredients for the perfect red lip. Um, first of all, you're gonna have to have some form of chapstick or lip balm or something. I am using the Carmex Comfort Care as their lip balm with shea butter. For the red lip, I am going with the Colored Rain um, in Cherry Blossom. I picked this up. I was in Chicago a couple of weeks visiting a friend and this Ulta, I don't remember where we were. We were in the heart of Chicago, I think somewhere around the loop. Um, and that Ulta had Colored Rain, so I picked this one up, and Cherry Blossom. It is a relatively brighter, if you guys can see, it's a relatively brighter red, not a red I would normally go for. So that's why I am going with lip liners. Both of these are by MAC Cosmetics. I'm not really sure which one I want to go with right now. Um, but one is Chestnut, and then one is Night Moth. So I'm just going to take my Carmex and thoroughly nourish my lips, because matte lipsticks are very drying on your lips. Um, Alright, next up we have the MAC Night Moth. All I'm going to do is line the outer part of my lips with this. Got that lined. I'm just going to simply rub it in, just only using my lips, so just and then put a little bit more on the outside. So that's how it should be. Not completely blended in because you're going to want to put the lipstick on your outer outer lips as well. But you still want it kind of like blended in just a little bit. Um, so I'm taking my lipstick. And I love that this has a nice precision point on it. And I'm just going to start on the inside. And see, so get that done. And now I'm going to take, because it has a precision point, I'm going to take it and pretend like basically lining your lips with the same lipstick. So I'm just going to take that. And use your fingers. Some people like it when your lipstick is all out and outside your, your lips. I think that's weird. That's not a trend I'm going to follow. So as I'm blotting and as I'm blending in, I'm just using my pinky fingers to kind of make sure it doesn't go like outside the lines. Alright, so guys, it is done. It is completely dry. So I am good probably for the next, probably for the next four to six hours. I think I did have to apply this one more time throughout the day. So it's not as, um, uh, not as long lasting as the Milani because you guys know Milani Devotion is normally my go-to red but that one is it has very drying features and so I was trying to do something not as drying. Anywho, um, like I said I use the Night Moth Lip Liner by my MAC Cosmetics. I cannot talk today. Let's get some water. So I did use the Night Moth by MAC Cosmetics and then I used the Colored Rain and Cherry Blossom. Which I think now they sell MAC at Ulta, so you can probably get both of them from Ulta and save yourself a trip to the MAC store. Um, so yeah, that is it, guys. If you, um, so the next one up on my mini tutorial list is how to do the eyebrows that you see right here. It legit took me less than two to three minutes to do my eyebrows. Absolutely loved it. Found a way that's easy for me to do, it's fast for me to do, and it's easy for me to teach. So that one will be coming up next, how I do um, my brows. If you guys have a mini tutorial that you guys would like for me to do, um, like for me to see, I know some person was like, says how are your eyelashes so flawless? Like how can you apply them so close to the lash line? That one's also in the pipeline how to easily and quickly apply lashes um but if you have anything else that you want me to do a mini tutorial on please feel free to leave it in the comment section below or you can email me or you can dm me on instagram however you want to get in contact with me just let me know and i can definitely add it to the list of things that you guys want to see in the meantime oh my throat is like in the meantime guys don't forget to check out all my other videos like comment and subscribe 
don't forget to follow you oh, don't forget to follow your girl on social media on instagram and also on my blog and i will catch you guys next week bye